Hey, how y'all doing today? Dana Standridge here, and I'm from the Deep South. And in the Deep South, we love our cornbread. And I'm going to give you a quick tutorial about how to make a basic cornbread recipe that's been handed down in my family for generations and generations. Now, where do I call home in the Deep South? That would be Alabama, sweet home Alabama. And this is our family cornbread. All right, first thing you're gonna need is a good cast iron skillet. And the next thing we're gonna do is crank up our oven to 475, and we're gonna put three tablespoons of shortening in our pan. Now, as that melts, we're going to put together a quick recipe for the cornbread. We're gonna need three-fourths cup of cornmeal. This is self-rising cornmeal, three-fourths cup. Then we're gonna need a fourth a cup of flour. This is self-rising flour. So the liquid that we're gonna use is three-fourths of a cup of buttermilk. So here we go. The next thing we're gonna need is an egg. We're gonna crack that right in and stir it up. Now here's one of our next secrets. You're gonna pour this three, almost three tablespoons in here, but you're gonna leave part of it behind in the skillet. Do you hear it sizzling? That's because it's very hot and bubbly and it's gonna start cooking our cornbread as soon as we pour it into the pan. It's gonna start cooking and crisping up the outside of that cornbread. Going in the oven, 475 for 10 minutes. You're gonna love it. Look here, here comes this delicious Southern cornbread right here just for you to enjoy. Really good. Southern cornbread, the state bread for Alabama.